So I've been thinking about GPU hosting services. Am I crazy or does it absolutely make sense? Let's talk about it. What is going on miners and welcome back to the Hobbyist Miner channel. Well, in today's video, we're gonna talk about GPU mining hosting services. And I wanna pump the brakes first, real quick. I wanna do a PSA. This video isn't sponsored by any individual company. It may originally come off as that, but I actually took the time to look into a few different companies out there, reached out to a company that offers GPU hosting services and asked to learn more actually met with them individually, and then I actually asked to trial their service in order to learn more about it so that I could share it with you guys. Because I absolutely identify the fact that not everybody can run a home crypto mining farm. Not everybody has the skill set to do it, has the electrical rate to do it, or even has the time to deal with it. So I wanted to find out what else more was out there for you guys to benefit from. So I wanted to share what I've learned with you. All right. PSA over, let's dive into it. Okay, so why would you consider going ahead and even remotely thinking about doing GPU mining hosting services? You know, why would you ever get into that? So let's take a step back. We're gonna put situations together. There's two situations here. First situation is you're a home miner currently. You're mining, you got a home crypto mining farm. And the second situation is you're thinking about getting into crypto mining during the current dip or quote bear market, whatever you guys want to call it right now. We're in May. If you're checking out this video, it was recorded in May of 2022. So let's talk about a few different reasons why you would even consider this. So the first reason that I found based off of researching this, looking into it, talking to some people that are even considering using GPU mining hosting services is they're just not tech savvy. You just don't have experience in the tech space to be building a mining rig or let alone, let's just say, building a computer, troubleshooting it, keeping it up and running, installing an operating system, setting a static IP address. Maybe all of that is completely beyond you. Hosting services or managed hosting services might be an option for you. In addition to that, let's say you're in like California or a whole other country where your electric rates are 40 some cents or more a kilowatt hour or something crazy where logistically it doesn't make sense. There's a lot of people I know that have been stepping into the space or been in this space for a while and have decided to sell off their hardware because the electric rate around them is just astronomical and through the roof and it's cut into their profit margin. So that's another reason. In addition to that, you don't have the home electrical to support it. Let's say you're in an apartment or a townhouse or you're in an HOA or you have an older home that, that, doesn't, that doesn't have, you know, like a 200 amp or 300, 400 amp, I guess it is, um, circuit that can benefit from it. Hosting services might be for you. In addition to that, let's talk about space. Mining hardware takes up space and a decent amount of it. In addition to that, managing the heat, heat management is a huge one. And it is not meant for your normal home crypto miner. I mean, talk to, if you are looking to get into mining, crypto mining, talk to any home crypto miner. They're going to tell you two major issues they struggle with every day. Heat management and power consumption, especially power distribution. Oh my gosh, talk about in your own home, going to different breakers, trying to get yourself covered and stuff like that. Ah, oh, it can be an absolute nightmare. So that's just a few reasons why anybody in the world would consider, hmm, maybe I look at something like GPU mining hosting services, especially paired with a managed service that is just like a turnkey solution that does everything for you and you just pay one set rate and you get to rack in that Ethereum or Bitcoin or whatever else you're mining. So few reasons why. Okay, so we spent uh, last few weeks or uh, last month or so, a little bit longer actually chatting with a few companies out there and I settled on one that I wanted to trial and test out and share with you guys. And that company would be CryptoCaverns.com. So I'm gonna put a link down to their website directly down below. Um, and uh, you guys can go over and check them out. And they have been an absolute pleasure to talk to. I mean, I I've jumped on Discord calls with them and they're just a bunch of crypto miners. And it's so cool to be kind of um, collaborate with them and chat with them and discuss with them 
you know, why this benefits people. And more and more, I'm, I'm seeing the light as to why this is super beneficial, especially when we're talking about some of the reasons that we looked at. There's so many people I've talked to over the last several months of being part of the content creation scene where they want to get into mining, but their electric rates are through the roof, or they want to get into mining and have no concept of technology or no concept of setting up a computer. And it was like, oh man, I got to find something for these people. Well, this is it. GPU hosting services, or more specifically, like a managed service. So today we're going to take a closer look at CryptoCaverns.com. Uh, we're going to take a look at my experience. Uh, I got myself uh, my hands on one for trialing it out. And it's an RX 580 rig. I'm like, yes, right up my alley. Um, and But we're going to look at some other options that they do have. Uh, and then I'm going to show you guys my dashboard as to what I see as a, quote, trial customer here. Uh, we're going to take a look at the pool uh, and uh, just kind of give you guys an idea as to what this looks like. Because I really do believe that hosting services are a thing. Now, if you haven't already canceled and closed this video out entirely, you're like, oh, I don't agree with him. I'm going to mine at home, blah, blah, blah. Just please keep in mind, not everybody is as tech savvy as you and I and is comfortable as you and I, or has the electric grade as you and I, or can handle the heat like we can. So if this benefits one person today, I will be pleased and I've done my job. All right, let's hop over to the computer and we're going to take a look at my experience and trial with CryptoCaverns.com. Alrighty, miners, we are over on the computer and we are at CryptoCaverns.com. I'll put a link directly down below. If you're on mobile or other platform and, and don't have an opportunity to get to the browser, uh, I'll put a direct link over to their website to make it easy for you in the description of the video. Uh, and actually, just as I'm recording this here, it looks like they have this like new banner at the top of their website. It says announcing Cavern Cores NFT, an NFT backed uh, by physical mining rigs, mine coins while you hold launching May 31st. So if you're into NFTs, check it out. Not my jam, but hey, I know a ton of you guys love it. So please go over and check that out. So uh, anyways, chatting with their team, they have two ways that they kind of sell to, to their customers. You can buy a full-blown built start to finish turnkey mining rig, or you can purchase a hosted mining rig. So if you come over to their website, there's a wholesale spot right at the top, click on that. And then uh, that's gonna go ahead and load up and show you a handful of different rigs. They have 3090s, 3070s, 3080s, 6700s, 5600XTs, 5700XTs. And this changes all the time I've noticed um, since I originally even started talking with them. So you can get them, uh, you could purchase them and they just ship the whole thing right to you, ready to go and ready to mine. Now, today's video, we're gonna talk about hosted rigs. So right now they only have one up here right now. Um, they've This, as I said, changes a lot based off of what they have in stock. Uh, right now they have an 8P106100 mining rig, uh, something that you can look at if you're interested. It does about 164 mega hash. Um, so if we go ahead and click into that, we can get more information on this hosted miner. And then I'm gonna show you guys my miner and what's been going on. So uh, they have everything listed down below here. It said it can mine Ethereum, Ethereum Classic, Bitcoin, Ravencoin, kind of whatever you're looking to do. It's not, if it, I see Bitcoin there, most likely they do some type of um, uh, flip kind of like uh, two miners and then flip it on the exchange. Uh, now, their pricing and their packaging, if you guys were curious on, because I did ask them about this, when you go ahead and buy this, it's $3,399. And you might be like, whoa, what the heck? Okay, you ready for this? Because this is all stuff I had to literally get on a call and meet with them on because I had to like try to understand their pricing model and their business model. This includes all the hardware, so your GPUs, Motherboard, you know, power supply, case, okay? Great, check. Next thing it includes your electricity for an entire year, as well as maintenance, repairs, and on top of that, it takes care of anything else that may be involved with setup, with overclocking. So all you do is click buy, you hand them your wallet, and you're done for the year. So that's kind of where this pricing model and their business model actually comes from. It took me a little bit to figure that out chatting with them. I was trying to wrap my head around it, especially as a home crypto miner. It was like, how exactly does this work? Okay, so let's um, jump over to my account. But before we do, if you still have a thousand questions, because I'm not going to lie, I picked their brain for a while. Uh, they actually have a decent FAQ. Go over and check it out uh, on everything with hosting and what's included and what's not included and all that fun stuff. Um, so Go check it out. I'll put a link down below uh, to their website if you're interested. So 
Let's take a look. So I went ahead, this is my account, uh, full transparency, I have nothing to hide. Um, I have a eight GPU 580 rig with them that I'm trialing. No commitments, no contracts, none of that stuff, trialing it out. Um, I told them that I was interested in taking a look at uh, kind of their services and their options and what is out there. And I was honest, I told them like, hey, I'm a YouTuber uh, in the space. Uh, I want to find something that is that is not traditional uh, for home crypto miners that gives people options that don't have options. And and I was like, let's go with like a 580. Let's be only because I wanted to be a little bit more realistic and not be like, give me an eight GPU 3090 rig. It was like, eh. Okay. So how does this work? So you you purchase and then you have an account just like I do here. You can come in and in your miner settings. Um, you put in your wallet address and then the coin that you want to mine. So I put in my Ethereum address. I selected what I wanted to mine. You click the I'm not a robot and hit submit. And then like all this is all the stuff they do on their side. They get it all set up and running and good to go. Uh, if uh, I run into any problems, I can come into minor support and I just open a ticket with them to address it. Remember, fully managed service, start to finish, completely turnkey. Finally, under orders, you could you could see, you know, uh, I don't have any orders, but this is where you can add in there and then addresses in there and account details and all that fun stuff. So that's as far as you go. I don't even have to deal with overclocking and I'll have to deal with keeping up with it or anything like that. So let's jump over to my pool. So um, it runs on Poolin. I chatted with them about it to kind of find out more information on, on kind of giving me a more of a deep dive. So uh, they told me that I'm on Poolin. I jumped over on Poolin. I put in my Ethereum address and bam. Here's all my information that we do see. So in real time, it does about 248 mega hash is what that's doing. And it shows me like today's estimates. Um, now granted the rig's off for recording purposes right now, or I'm sorry, wow, the rig's not off. It's not at home. <laughs> I shut off all my rigs here. This rig is not here, so it's not off. So uh, if I go ahead and jump over, you can see like on pull-in, you can see workers and you can see it's just this one worker that we do have. Um, under earnings, if you're curious on it, we can pop over here. So I started mining on this rig back on April 29th. And you can see every day, you know, you actually you can see it got spun up. Don't even have a full day. My full day starts on the 30th. And then you can see every day the amount of earnings that I'm actually making. Um, and then that comes all the way through. I mean, there's so much transparency here. It makes it really easy. Every day you see bam, 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 and comes up to today. Uh, and shows that detail. You can actually see, look at that network difficulty, talking about Ethereum, you can see that's rising pretty quickly there. So if you're curious on, on exactly where my balance is, I started on the 29th and we're at 0 0.08 Ethereum right now. So super close to that threshold of 0.1 Ethereum. I should be hitting that uh, here soon actually, uh, based off of this, which would be fantastic uh, once we get that paid out. But the dashboard makes it very easy to track, very easy to keep up with. Um, you can set up alerts so you get emails when it, when it goes down, which I've had no issues, which is fantastic, uh, but it's a great option. So I totally understand. Hosted services and managed services with GPU mining might not be for you. It's okay. I actually really enjoyed spending the time looking into this and chatting with CryptoCaverns.com and just learning exactly how this all works. One of the things I actually came up with was, well, what happens after a year after I've, you know, I've purchased it and, you know, for, let's say that $3,300 price point on the P106s, you know, and let's say after that year, you're like, nah, I'm not interested in having it hosted anymore. I, I have a place that I could, that I want to do it at home now. I'm more knowledgeable. They shut it down, pack it up and they ship you your unit. It's as simple as that, which is really, really cool. So uh, I would recommend that if you're in a spot where you want to get into crypto mining, and especially GPU mining, you have the money to invest, but you don't know where to start. You, you, you can't deal with the electric. You don't know nothing about computers, but you do want to, you know, take the opportunity now to financially invest in it. This is a great option for you, but do your own research. Look at the different companies that are out there. Find one that you believe aligns with what you're looking for. Do and, and definitely deep dive into it, you know, cover your bases. And, and then go for it. Why not, right? I'd hate to have people that are interested in the crypto mining space, but there's just no options for them. This is it. GPU hosting mining services might be for you. Well, that's it, guys. That's a quick video. I'd love to get some feedback down below from you. But as I said before, keep in mind, not everybody can be a home crypto miner. So this is just one option for that. So curious, 
Comment down below, have you considered something like this? Maybe, maybe not. Is this a good option for you? Have you started turning off rigs because your electric rate is too high, profitability is too low? Uh, have you considered selling rigs? Uh, does this look like a possible opportunity for you? You know, not everybody's got that buddy where it's like, hey, you're a few states over, your electric rate's awesome, can I send my rigs to you? Not always the case. Well guys, hopefully you enjoyed today's video, something different, but I really enjoyed it. If you enjoyed the video too and learning a little bit more, give it a thumbs up, one of these. And don't forget if you're brand new to the channel, welcome. Go ahead and click that subscribe button to be notified every time I drop a video. Until next time guys, take care.